Four years of transition and uncertainty were put to an end today at the Augusta Levy Learning Center. Their new forever home isn't just a new space to serve children with autism. It's a space that will grow with them. 7 News reporter Colin Roos got a look at the superheroes inside after the ribbon was cut this afternoon. He joins us live. Colin. Taylor, originally Augusta Levy was an early intervention center with no students older than eight, but they began to help with the tough transition into adolescence seven years ago, and at one o'clock today that promise was truly fulfilled. Every room of the building is a growing step from those first words to a career in the real world. 17 years of continuous commitment, renewed with the reveal of a bright blue building. Augusta Levy held the grand opening of their new Fortress for Heroes, which they say is a massive upgrade from any of the learning center's previous spaces. After a fire destroyed their North Wheeling home in 2018, they moved into temporary classrooms while they rebuilt their vision from the ground up. While they moved in early last year, they never got a chance to show its full potential to the public until now. Especially through the past four years, to go through the fire, to go through the pandemic, um, to lose a staff member during the pandemic. Their services have been invaluable to Wheeling and West Virginia since 2005. Working with children on the autism spectrum, their approach goes far beyond standard school subjects. There, we work on everything from how to learn, to teaching children how to speak and find their voices, to taking care of themselves, self-care. And now they'll be able to fulfill their mission like never before. With double the classroom size and rooms for early intervention and preteens, they're ready to grow with their children. And as you may have noticed, all with a superhero theme to remind the kids of their potential. We can program for our kids within our walls. Um, everything is tailored for their individual needs. For the older kids, there's even an apartment with a washer, dryer, and kitchen to help build the independence they'll need for that first job. We have graduates um, who are now, you know, working out in the community or continuing their education and they talk about what an impact this had on them. The building may mark an end point to Augusta Levy's long journey, but for the children who develop in their care, it's only the beginning of theirs. The officials I spoke with all wanted to say how, once again how grateful they are for all the community help following the fire. They say they never could have made it to this day without it. Live in the 7 News studio, I'm Colin Roos, working for you.